If you install the latest firmware on your Kodak ZI8 camera and you no longer have the ArcSoft Media Impression software on the camera, I'm going to show you how to get it back. This is the Kodak.com website. You go to Kodak.com, choose support, choose the video camera, choose ZI8, and it takes you to a place where you can download the new firmware. So when you click download, you're taken to this page that gives you a set of instructions on exactly how to update that firmware. If you no longer have the ArcSoft Total Media, well, ArcSoft Media Impressions software, you haven't followed the step, step two. So what I did, because I did this same thing, was I just did this all over again, only following the second set of instructions very carefully. I went and downloaded the software over again, which is this little exe file. Uh, I expanded it into the ZI8 folder. There's the two files. Now you can see the file size on these files that second one is is the media impression software you can tell but anyway in the so the first one's your firmware upgrade actually that would be like on the ZI6 that'd be a bin file but anyway so you go to the uh, SD card on your camera you create a new folder called system oops I'm doing this while holding the camera, which probably isn't a really good idea. Expand that out, copy these two files down to that folder, down to that system folder. I'll take you out of macro, but then you won't be able to see what's, uh, what I'm doing. And now I'm dragging those two folders down to here. Okay, so now that's inside the camera. You put the SD card back in the camera, or if you left it inside the camera, that's fine too. Um, but then, then follow the instructions over here. The, turn the camera off, turn it back on, let it upgrade the firmware. Then notice that there's a second set to this instruction that says, caution, you must complete the following step to reinstall Kodak Media Impression, ArcSoft Media Impression for Kodak software on your camera. Turn your camera off, turn it back on, choose a red check mark, hit go, and it will update the ArcSoft software and turn the camera off. That's the step that that people are missing. So all you got to do is do that part, and and uh, you'll get your ArcSoft uh, Media Impression software back. So I hope this helped you. And I'm still Jan.com. Uh, please subscribe, rate, and all that sort of stuff, and be kind on your comments. <laughs> Thank you. Have a good day.